Well, today we're here with Andy. She's just getting her house built. And uh, hi to everyone in, Par in Parkway Church. Um, we just wanted to tell y'all just a few things about her life and how long she's been waiting, stuff like that. Her just normal life. Um, she's been living here five, uh, seven years, and um, she lives here with by herself and her son and her. Her son is three years old. Um, and she has been waiting for this house that we're that all are finishing right now uh, five years. So most of the time she's been waiting here. Está um, emocionada. Um, well, she's really, really excited about having this house, and um, she saw that you know she, she that there was a lot of people getting their houses built before her, and she and you know several times, you know, several years passed, and she was like, well, when is my time going to come? And then now, now that her time has come, she's just really, really happy and really grateful to everyone that's helped on her house. You know, the the, the guys that helped out from here, the Parkway team, and uh, one team that we helped out one before. Um, y usted um, quiere decir algo a este grupo? Bueno, eh, si aparte de decirle algo, eh, lo que quiero decir es que um, well, other than saying much thanks, she knows that without the power of God and the help of God, nothing is possible. Because in three occasions they left her out. They told her time and time again that she didn't need a house because she had one. Because she had a car, and, and, I, and like they say, only one knows the, the hardship. Um, the car isn't really hers. No, um, it's just lent to her by uh, by a friend of hers. Uh, and that's one of the main reasons why why they say that she didn't need a house because uh, she had a car, she had a, 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 a nice looking house, but they really didn't know the facts, the facts that it was leaking, the facts that it was old, that it had problems, and that she, you know she was desperately needing uh, a new house. That every time it rained, it flooded. Yeah, she really, really needed that house. Um, this house that y'all are, are finishing. Her, she, uh, she even sometimes had to get up in the middle of the night to, to, to throw water out with buckets. Ever since her husband died and she was left alone with her son, she's battled a lot with. Um, she uh, she searched for people that'll fix the house, that'll that'll just work here and there to do things, and uh, they always do. They always charge a lot. They never do the right job. Oh, and so she said one day, and she would always pray that this would come true, one day God will give her the green light and she will get that house that she needed so badly. Um, she is mother and father to, the, to her son. Uh, she has to work when she needs to buy food, water, um, and anything else, clothing, shoes, 
and anything else she needs. Era difícil yo hacer mi casa. And having all of those expenses, it was really impossible to build her own house. And that's why the first day when we saw Owen, I saw that group come through that gate with all those shovels and, and pickaxes. I was speechless. I said, finally, they're going to make my house. God, you listen to my prayers. I prayed every day, day after day. Dios, por favor, ilumina la mente de estas personas. Um, enlighten these people to the truth that I really do need a house. De buen corazón. To these people that have such big hearts. Yeah. Eh, que don Henry. That, um, that Mr. Henry is in charge of. Que algún día a ver para acá. That one day they look this way. Yeah. And they make my house. Y ahora, and tengo. now I have it. Muy feliz. And I'm really, really happy and very grateful. I'm really, really excited. Awesome.